In a room full of journalists and about 100 cameras, Peter Limjianrat did what no one thought possible a few years ago or even a few weeks ago. He declared victory for his young progressive party, Move Forward. It ran with a risky agenda in conservative Thailand of vowing to end military conscription, end monopolies and amend the law which makes criticising the powerful monarchy a crime. But with huge gains, including an almost clean sweep of seats in Bangkok, Mr Peter said it was clear Thai voters were ready for change. Today is a new day and hopefully it's full of bright uh, sunshine of hope going forward. Thai politics is complicated though and winning the most seats is only the start of the battle. The main opposition party Pua Thai, led by Peitong Tan Shinawat, the daughter of divisive former PM Thaksin, came in a close second. Mr Peter says he's asked Ms Peitong Tan, as well as five smaller parties, to join a coalition with him. And while he's declared victory and said he'll be the Prime Minister, the vote for PM in Thailand is something entirely removed from the election. The person is chosen by the 500 elected members of the lower house and the 250 members of the military appointed Senate. So even though voters delivered a resounding rejection of military at the ballot box, the military can still manoeuvre its way into deciding who forms the next government. And if it does, there's already talk that Thais will take out their anger on the streets.